I do not look too bad in a hat. Yeah, I, I absolutely like it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you've been here before, if not, my name is Donella. Um, it's, again, been a week. Um, a lot of ups and downs going on. My pants are finally back out. So, for those of you guys who don't know, I have these crazy pants where I took, I took pants and I cut the one leg off and made them shorts. And I'm wearing them right now. Let's see them. So, like, yeah, look at that. I mean, besides my fat, but like, I like them. Like, there's the pant leg, and here's the shorts. Yeah, they're fun. Fun, 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 fun. So, I have a lot of energy because I just ate a lot of sugar. And I have a soda here. Yeah. Hyper, hyper, hyper. So, and it is, what time is it? My phone's not smart. 12.04, which I guess I could have just looked at the computer screen. 12.04, and I normally don't post the film a video before, like, 10 at night. So, because I had some free time today. But today i'm going to be talking about my sorority so let's get into it so for those of you who don't know i am in a sorority as you probably can tell by my hat and my letters that i'm wearing right now um i'm in a sorority and i love it i absolutely do um but you know the thing is is we are a group of females, so there are, there's not drama, I don't want to say, but it tends to become a lot, but with bad times, there are also some very, very good times, and we are not a social sorority, um, so we do service, um, with that being said, we do a lot of service. And, you know, we bond through the service. We bond through helping people. And that's one of the things why I wanted to join this sorority was because we get together and we, you know, bond over service. And I don't know how many times I can say bond in this video excuse me um but we do like we help out the community which is one of the most important things in my life is I love helping people um and we do do go out and like we enjoy we have fun um so just a couple of days ago we went to go get crepes um and you know we just had formal that was absolutely fun so formal is just you know it's sort of like a, a dance we have like dinner and then we have like a dance and we can bring dates um and we just it's just a lot a lot of fun um and i think the one thing that the reason why i sort of wanted to film this video um is because I think people are honestly really scared about sororities because you hear a bunch of lot of, of Greek life in general, not just sororities, but you have a lot of news out there giving stories that aren't technically true in a sense. Like they just sort of want to get what they think is happening but they don't really know the whole story um for one thing my sorority does not haze and we're non-selective which i think 
what I said before is like there's like not drama, but we don't see eye to eye all the time. Um, and I think that's because we're not all the same person, which not that all sororities are. Like, and I, at my school, we, we have a couple of different sororities and fraternities, and we seem to get along just fine. So this is not trash talking any of them. It's not trash talking my own sorority. Um, but we don't see eye to eye on a lot of things. And I like that in a way because we're not all the same person. We're not all um, the same. We don't all think the same. We all have different opinions, um, you know, and without being in a sorority, I don't think I would have met the friends that I had. Um, we all support each other. Like I'm walking around with one-legged pants. And my sorority sisters still accept me for it. Like, who else walks around with one-legged pants? Me. I'm probably the only one. And they still accept me for it. And yes, we joke around with each other. And yes, we laugh at each other. And just, we make fun of each other. Like, I go around and I call people idiots or losers or mispronounce their names because it's funny. Um, but, you know, we do this, like, they do the same thing to me. And, like, and it could, it can get, it can get, like, a little upsetting sometimes, like, when it's, like, a constant thing. But at the end of the day, it's, like, I would not trade these people for anything at all um I think I think having my sisters around really has helped me in a way because I have someone to lean on um when I was before I joined a sorority I was this person who sat at the table alone I mean I still do that because loser but they they come over and they sit with me or I have someone to talk to and you know it's it's an amazing experience because you don't really know who you're gonna get in the sorority um because we're so different and I love that about us um so I think there I mean again like there are ups and downs but I do think the ups really outweigh the bad most of the time um and you like you have those bad days when you're like i don't really want to like at least i do where i'm like don't really want to be here don't really you know i don't really want to be around anyone so it's not just them it's like don't want to be around a single person and i still i'm still there um, without being in a sorority, I would have nev would have never met my little. Um, I was absolutely the sweetest, caring, funniest person ever, and she gives me sass, and I give her sass right back. Like it, somebody in our sorority actually just called it a tennis match because it's this back and forth sassiness of a time I don't know um but we can just sass each other anywhere like like we can just be crossing the hall and we could like say something and you know she is like my little sister she is someone who I can go to and talk and um you know and like her actual sister um is also in the sorority and I feel really close to her, too, because we ended up going to France together, which would be another another video at some point. And um, I think without being in a sorority would have never helped me find who my friends are. And we do have, like, those ups and downs, like I, I, I keep saying, because I think people think that... Sorority life is all glitz and glam and absolutely perfect and not 
our sorority. Um, and I think all Greek life members, they do have their secrets, obviously. Like, you can't tell people what you're going to do. Like, and not just haze. Like, my again, my sorority does not haze. Um, I don't think any sorority on our campus hazes any Greek life. I say keep saying sorority because I'm in one, but I don't think, like, my school has a strict no hazing policy. If you get caught doing something you're not supposed to, um, I actually don't know what happens because, again, like, we don't do it. Um, I don't think any other sorority has ever done it. Um, again, like, I can't really talk about other sororities, but I absolutely love, 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 love my sorority. Um, and without them, I don't think I would have, like, joined Greek Life. I don't think I would be the person that I am today. I don't think I'll be filming this YouTube video. Um, one, because they are really supportive of me and we can go back and actually make fun of my videos. Um, because I am not very good at this. But, you know, it is what it is and I'm just setting out. And so I think, I think if anyone out there wants to join Greek Life, I think they should go ahead and do it. Because you never know who is going to be in that tour. You, I made probably my best friends. I have one best friend from, like, back home. But I think, like, most of my friends has come from my sorority. Um, and, you know, I don't think that's a bad thing. Um, yeah, I... I think that if you want to join Greek Life, I think you should go ahead and do it. I think you, like, I didn't join until I was a junior. Um, I'm a senior, I'm a second year senior. Um, so, I think you should go ahead and do it. Um, try to find the sorority that best matches your ideals and your attitudes and your personality. Um, because if you don't, then you're just going to, I think you're going to be miserable. Um, but I recommend that anyone join a Greek life organization and, you know, figure out what best fits you because I am so glad I did join a Greek life organization, um, and we just have, we have so much fun together, um, and, you know, and you're not, this is one of the things, like, I get asked, is, d did you buy your friends, and we do have dues, um, I think our dues, our dues are not expensive, I think I'm paying like 150, I believe, and it's not bad. Like that's like a year. Um, I don't think it's bad. And did I buy my friends? Maybe, maybe I did. Um, but they're worth a whole lot more than 150 dollars. Um, so I think I'm just gonna leave it at that. And sort of, if you guys have any questions or any comments um, about Greek life, I would love to answer them. Um, but I do recommend if you're thinking about it or on the fence to go ahead and just do it. Be like Nike and do it. Because I think if you don't take the chance, you're going to really regret it. And... If you do take the chance and you don't, and you end up loving it, then you took the you took the chance and you loved your sisters and you, or not even sisters, but like 
whatever Greek organization you join, you're gonna love the people in it. I highly rec like I highly think that. If you don't, you know, the um just stay in it for a little while and if it's still something you don't want to do, there's always ways of leaving. Um but I love my sorority. I honestly um, wouldn't change anything about it. I mean, I would change some things, but um, that's that's just in general, like different things. But I would not change the people. I would not change anything that we do. So I um, do believe that you guys should absolutely join it if you want to. Um, and it's, it's honestly a big supportive family. All right, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to leave a comment, please comment down below. I don't really know what I'm saying. Um, if you want to know when I post videos, I post videos every Wednesday. I've been trying to, I've been doing pretty well on it. I think one day I posted on Thursday at like 12.02 in the morning. It's not the point. But I do post videos every Wednesday. Um, if we can get this up to 50 views, I will probably post more videos. Hopefully on Saturdays and call it Scary Stories Saturday. Um... So yeah, guys, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I enjoyed talking about it. And I'll see you guys next week with a hopefully FabFitFun box. So I'll see you guys next week. Bye.